Hey, I'm Brittany Sullivan with the Red Carpet Report here in Beverly Hills for the second annual Bloom Summit. Ready to go. Do you usually, are you a morning workout person or late night? What's your go-to routine? For, for working out? Yeah. Um, it's usually, a, my yoga instructor is one of my besties today. So. <laughs> um, she comes to the house three times a week. Yeah. Um, Monday's Friday. Uh, I'm sorry. Monday is 5 o'clock p.m. Wednesday, 5 o'clock p.m. Then Saturday we do at noon. And that seems to be a time that's working out for us. Yeah. So. Nice. So you can, like, enjoy, you know, your Friday night a little bit, sleep in, and really start off the, the Yeah, zen. the sleeping in thing uh, is hard because if I'm working, I have to be up at 4 a.m. So my body is kind of used to getting up at that time. My brain is not. <laughs> Never will be. But, um, yeah. Yeah, if only you could force your body to sleep four hours yes. later on a day when you know you don't have to get up, your body doesn't know that. Right? <laughs> yes, sleep, it's it's definitely not overrated, definitely something we need more of, but it's hard to get, you know, when you're busy and you're working, you're doing all of these things. Like I, I just celebrated 40 years on my show. When you've done Congratulations. The same thing, thank you. When you do the same thing for 40 years, as far as getting up at a certain time, you can't beat that out of your system. That's it, I think, for life, <laughs> unfortunately. You teach me your ways. I am definitely like more of a night owl and I need to oh, get... I, I am. Are you I, really? I am. I mean, if I could live the life I wanted, it didn't have work calls and all these other responsibilities, I would be up till two every night because that's when I come alive. That's when my mind comes alive. But um, not really permissible with a show like that. Yeah. So how, how's that going? Are you... How... It's a good trade-off though. Yeah. Don't get me wrong. Yeah. <laughs> so what's been your favorite part working on, on the show? Um, this past year, what's like the most memorable moment you can take away just from the whole season? Oh golly, that, that's a very <laughs> difficult question. Um, I have to just say the ramp up and the eventual celebration of my 40th anniversary was so far and above what I was expecting. I mean, they wrote a special episode about it. I mean, we had hundreds of people on the stage for my party and it was, it was just, it, it blew me away. And um, I guess I didn't really understand what a milestone 40 years is until they showed me. Right. And because you don't really think about it, you go along about your business, you do your show, and other your passes. You don't think about 40s coming, 40s coming until you're there. And then it's a little overwhelming, but it was just amazing. Amazing. It makes me love them all even more that they did so much for me. It becomes more of like a family environment than just oh, people you work with. Very much so. Very much so. Um, we have a lot of wine our people here today, and uh, we, we, yeah, we're, I mean, we're all out in the hallway hugging and, you know, we love each other. We're, we are a family. We love each other more than we would if they were real family. <laughs> we'll, we'll make sure to cut that apart, you yeah. Oh, I don't care. It's okay. But you know what? Friendship and, and working together is just so important because, you, you know, you're taking on, you're, you're with them more than any other time of the day. Right. And, and... You know, when you're on a show this long, we're a company, mm -hmm. and that means family. Package. That means family, yeah. And if you screw with one of our own, we're all going to come after you. So, um, spoken we're, fiercely we're, in the leather jacket. We're a fierce crowd. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, is there any kind of um, workouts that you guys do together, or is it just that's separate from work? You more of you know. At, Oh, uh, yeah, no. I, well, I don't. Maybe, <laughs> maybe some of the kids do, and I don't know it. I don't know. <laughs> well, thank you so much for chatting with me, and I hope you enjoy the event. Thank you.